Hello, this is Brent Vartstra from LearnJazzStandards.com, and I'm just going to talk to you uh, really quickly today and give you a quick tutorial of how to set up your own website using Wix.com. And if you're not uh, checking out this video on the website, I highly encourage you to check out the link below if you're on YouTube and read the article. I'm talking about the great importance of having your own website as a musician. It's incredibly important. Uh, to have an online presence as a musician to you know it's basically like a glorified business card you have a place to send people whether it be for gigs whether it be for education purposes um, or even selling your own uh, music products or your albums um, it's just basically a place to send people um, and it's done great wonders for me um, having a website has gotten me a book deal it's it's done different things for me um, and I highly encourage it. So if you're not on the website, check out this article and follow along. I talk about the importance of having a website as a musician, incredibly important. Um, so quickly, what, what is Wix? So Wix is a cloud-based web de development platform that allows you to host and create your own web page, and you don't need any experience uh, to make it. So you don't need any web develop development experience, no design experience. You can basically make it all on your own. Uh, there's, there's, there's nothing complicated about it. Anybody can do it. Um, it's an excellent service. And, and let me just clarify all this really quickly. I know there are other services just like this that exist out there. I'm talking from my own personal experience. Um, I've really enjoyed using Wix. Um, it's, it's a very flexible platform to use. Uh, tons and tons of great templates. Pricing is, is really great. Um, and so I'm just talking from my own personal experience, something that I would highly recommend using. So, uh, you know, without further ado, let me just start walking through, you know, how you can set up your own website with Wix um, and just, just a few different features um, that you can use on Wix and, you know, some different reasons why you should do it, essentially. So uh, here I am right here on Wix.com. So it's www.wix.com. And I'm here in the templates tab. Um, and this is basically where we can start and, um, you know, start building a website. And one thing I, I really like about Wix um, that I would say differentiates from some that are specifically for music is I, I actually like the fact that there are templates for all of these different kinds of businesses, whether it be photography or, or just business um, law, you know, looking through all of these right here. And, and there's tons and tons of these templates. And I like that a lot. I like that I don't have to base my website that I'm making solely off of a musician uh, template for a website if I don't want to, if maybe I don't like one of them, or or maybe I just want my website to have a little bit more flexibility with what it can do and the different features that it has. So I really like that about Wix. That's something that's really helpful to have. Um, and, and there's just hundreds and hundreds of templates on here. Um, you know, but since we're obviously talking more about music, um, I'm just going to go here to the music section for templates here, just so you can kind of get a look. Uh, you know, again, lots of templates here to work with. Um, really nice looking websites, different styles, um, different designs um, that you can work with, basically. And, and I'm going to make a really quick suggestion if you're going to start making a website with Wix. You know, don't uh, stray, unless you're a really great designer, I wouldn't personally stray too far away from the original templates. I mean, it'll become original in your own when you add your own photography in there, when you add your own text um, and your own music and different things inside of that uh, template. It'll look original, but unless you have really good design eye and maybe some experience, I would probably consider, you know, sticking a little bit closer to the templates. And they're all really great templates. Um, so I'm just going to go and show you, you know, the template that I eventually used for my website here. Um, and that was this one. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click edit here. And I'm already logged in because I have a, an account with them. And all you have to do is, you know, basically I jumped a step. You would have to create an account, um, which is pretty basic, you know, it, you fill in your information and you just clarify uh, through email that you signed up. And then you can go ahead and start editing your, your brand new website. Um, so here I am, and this is basically the editor, the Wix editor. And it's really simple and it's really easy to use. 
Um, here up here is where you can manage your pages. So right now I'm, on, I'm working on the home page. If I wanted to work on uh, the music page, I could click here and I can edit this. Um, but just to show you a few things on the home page, you know, it's pretty basic. If I want to edit the text here, I can do that. Um, let's just say I want to put in my name. Okay, um, maybe I want to write, I'm a jazz guitarist, so I'm going to write jazz guitarist. And obviously what I can do is I can, uh, you know, fix this text so that it's um, smaller and, and fits better. And I'll show you what I ended up doing with my website. I basically followed this template, but I'm just showing you what you can do for now. Um, there's lots of other things you can add. Um, here you can add different text boxes, different titles. You can add images. Um, you can add a gallery, um, different buttons that you want to go places. I mean, the possibilities are, are pretty endless here. I mean, there's boxes, shapes. You can add your own videos if you want to have videos on your website of you playing. You know, I wouldn't put it on this page, but you can do that and then embed your YouTube video into there. Um, I'm going to delete that. Um, what else can you do here? Um, oh, great contact boxes. You can add social uh, social media buttons. And here's the really cool thing for musicians. They have really basic players, but they have a great player called Wix Music, um, which is looks really great. It looks amazing. You can also sell your music from that. And that's a different premium plan, which I'll go over some of the pricings later. But it's a really awesome tool. It looks really nice. Um, and you can also sell your music through this. Now, one thing I love about this is Squix allows you to integrate all sorts of things. As you can see, you can integrate a Spotify player if that's what you wanted to do, or a SoundCloud player. So for any of you that have SoundCloud, which I know a lot of a lot of you do for your have for your music, I know I do, you can actually just integrate a SoundCloud player here. And I would do this on the music page, not on the home page, by the way. And you can just embed um, your SoundCloud links into your player so that they'll play there. Um, let's just quickly look at some more of this page. Um, so yeah, I mean, first of all, the template looks great. You insert your own picture, add your own quotes, um, add your own text in here. Here's that, um, here's that Wix player for you, Wix music player, and what that kind of looks like right here. Um, some videos beneath. You can add your own videos. You can get rid of the videos if you don't have any. Uh, this particular website also has a tour page, so you can log in your gigs that you have coming up, different events you have coming up that you want people to know about. Um, the galleries are, are really amazing. Lots of really great galleries. And there's a lot of different choices of styles of galleries too, which is something I really like about Wix. Um, here's electronic press kit. So, you know, there's buttons utilized in here, the players utilized in here again. And this is just a simple contact page. Here's some social media buttons and whatnot and different information right here. So, and, and I can customize all of this. I can change all of this. Um, and it, it's really handy. Um, another really cool thing actually that I want to show you is you can actually add your own store. Uh, here it is. I'm going to add that to the website. Okay. So if you have products that you want to sell, you know, you can make a page called store or shop or whatever you want to call it. And you can custom add your products into here. Basically you just click on manage your products and, you know, just start um, adding your own pictures and adding um, your own shipping information, uh, how much you're selling it for. It, it, it's actually pretty impressive what it can do. Um, if you're not interested, this also comes at a different premium level. Um, costs a little bit more for this service to, to sell things on your website. So if you're not into that, again, another great inter integration that's free actually um, is, if I can find it, um, Well, I'll show you on my website, um, but it's uh, PayPal buttons. And, uh, you know, let's just do that right now. Let me quickly show you what I've done um, to my website with this exact template. This is brentvartstra.com. So you can see I customized the text, put my own picture in, about section, changed it the way I like it, got my own information in there. 
Um, the music player, I didn't want to pay for the Wix music, so I actually just put in my SoundCloud stuff, and it looks great to me. Um, my, here's my writing page. I talk about my writing on LearnJazzStandards.com and my book, 500 Jazz Licks from Hal Leonard. Um, here's the teaching page I made. talks about my uh, teaching services um, through Skype and uh, locally here in New York City. And uh, here's my gallery. Just added all my professional headshots in there. Did create a store. And here's those PayPal buttons I was talking to you about. Basically, if I wanted to purchase this practicing guide here, if, I, if someone wanted to, they could click on this. And that's going to lead them straight to PayPal. And they can, someone can go ahead and purchase this. It has all my PayPal information into it. And it doesn't cost me anything to do this. So that's a free um, option. Uh, the contact section, I added a nice little... Uh, anonymous contact box in here that leads directly to my personal um, email. Um, okay, so that's basically a run through of Wix, how it works, how you can uh, you know, make a great looking website for your music. Um, and let's just quickly run over the purchasing. So first of all, there is um, uh, payment options, premium options for just regular customers and then actual musicians. So let me go over the regular pricing first. And let me just say, it's it's a really great deal. It starts here at four, basically $4 a month. Um, I would highly suggest not doing this. Um, for one, you don't get a free domain name, which every other plan offers you a free domain name here, which is really nice. You don't have to buy a domain somewhere else. If you do already have a domain name, you can go ahead and actually integrate that with the site. So it's not a problem if you already have one purchased, but you do get a free one with all the plans except for this most basic one, which also has Wix brand ads on it. And I would suggest not doing that. They're really big, they're annoying. You don't want people to see them there. You know, you wanna look as professional as possible. So I would definitely suggest not doing this. But a better plan, and this is the plan that I use, it's the combo plan here. It's only $9.25 a month, incredibly good deal. You can basically do everything that I did on my website. Um, and I, I, I obviously cut some corners, I, um, you know, didn't get the Wix store. I didn't get the Wix music. Um, I just use SoundCloud. I use PayPal buttons. Um, so you don't have to do this stuff. Um, this is the unlimited plan here. Um, th this e-commerce plan is where you can integrate the Wix store and start selling products. So let's quickly go over the, the, mu the musician pricing though. So it's a little bit more expensive. Um, which is why if you don't want to use any of these features, I would suggest, again, going back and doing this combo deal right here. Um, but otherwise, you do get Wix music um, for all of these packages. Uh, the one that I would say, I guess this one that they have highlighted here is probably the best deal. Um, Commission-free sales. You get to put 10 albums up there for sale. Um, your domain name is free again. And if you want to sell stuff as well as Wix Music, you're paying a little bit more. You're paying $18 a month. So you don't have to do any of that stuff. If you find that it's uh, worth it to do that, then by all means, that's a great option for you to do. Um, and if you like the way the Wix Music player looks and you like you have a lot of products to sell and you like the way the store works, um, there's a lot you can do with those stores. Definitely worth it um, if, you're, if you're needing to do that. Um, then go ahead and do that. Otherwise, you know, just do a regular plan here and... Um, you know, pay for this combo deal or one of the other ones. So it's a great deal. So that's all I have to really say about Wix. Um, something I would highly recommend, and I obviously uh, would highly recommend having a website if you're a musician. Um, and, you know, again, go to the link below if you're on YouTube and not on the website to check out the article where I talk about the importance of having a website as a musician. So thanks for listening and good luck with all your musical endeavors.